What is up guys, we are back with some more Pokemon Sword and we just got to Magnolia's house and she told Leon to basically endorse us because, you know, we kind of were complaining that he didn't endorse us yet. Um, so what we're going to have to do is convince Leon that we are ready to take on the gym challenge and he wants us to have a Pokemon battle in order to prove that. Um, sorry about this guys, like I'm trying to see like what all I can find. Ooh, what's this? A TM? Ah, oh, that might be... Oh, that might be good to put on Nicket since it's dark type so it gets stabbed but then it's also a move that deals extra damage from getting hit already. So if I'm ever like slower than somebody, that might be best to use it. You've got to battle me so I can get myself that endorsement. Alright Hop, let's go bro. And let's see. Uh, I think we're ready. And to do that, I need that endorsement to take part in the gym challenge. Come at me with everything you have so we can prove to Lee that we've got what it takes. Of course. I'm rather interested in seeing how you two young trainers battle too. Listen, you two, the reason I'm unbeatable is because I learn from every battle I see or take part in. That's how I've gotten to where I am today, so show me something good in this battle. It's time for my legend to begin. You are challenged by Pokemon Trainer Hop. Huh? Let's go, boy. Oh, he has three Pokemon. I have my team of six. <laughs> yeah, but I knew he was going to start off with that Wooloo. Have you gotten a bit stronger? Me and my team will put you to the test and see. Level 6. Let's do Home Claws. I might use Home Claws twice. Since I have that orange berry on me. I wasn't expecting that. Yeah, I think that's why I use it twice, just in case you use Growl on me, so my attack is still somewhat boosted. And then I can kind of just do a little swap out depending on which food he sends out next. Okay, level 9. Chudel levels up slow, so I don't know if Chudel's like gonna be like extremely strong or not. Alright, that was a good job, Nikki. And your soft was level 8. Ooh, we almost one hit KO. Well, look at you, seems like you've really learned your type matchups. Habitation or a true power, this wave is gonna crash right over you. What's your move? No, it's just one match. Ah, sucks to be you. My Pokemon has like a brand new move. Hit level eight. I don't use brow. <laughs> I don't ever use brow now that I think about it. Oh, you better send out a rookie dude. Um, I think I want rookie versus rookie. Oh, uh, there's 
level 5. It's all good, bro. Neither of us need very good. It's funny because when I was first starting off playing Pokemon, I used to never use power up moves like growth or anything. Because I kind of felt like it wasn't going to really do much. These are both of strength and attacks the target. The more these stats are raised, the greater the moves power. Okay. Well, I just used Tony Claw, so that should do a lot. I'm kind of disappointed. He said he was going to train up his team, but it doesn't seem like he's trained his team. <laughs> but that's Brick D for the win. And he hit level 10. Glad that I lost, but I'd expect nothing less from my rival. And I even get my Pokeball throw perfect too. The sting of defeat and the joy of victory. I guess going through both is key to the two of us getting stronger, right? <laughs> yes, sir. But I don't think you're gonna get that strong on me. Not if you're raising Pokemon to like level 5. Blades, huh? Well, after seeing a match like that one, I suppose I have little choice but to give you both an endorsement as champion. That's actually interesting on how you can um, do the gym challenges, is that you need somebody to endorse you. You've obtained a letter of endorsement and a letter of recommendation that you'll need in order to participate in the gym challenge. Yes, thanks, Lee. I swear I'm going to win my way through the gym challenge to reach you. You may both be young still, and plenty of rock around the edges, but it was a proper battle. Charizard and I were both feeling the excitement in every last cell in our body. Huh, you've always tended to get caught up in things like how you throw your Pokemon out, things that have nothing to do with the real strength. Honestly, I've been worried about you still obsessing over that sort of mouth, but it seems you have really grown a bit, little brother. And I'd like to see some more thrilling Pokemon battles out of you too, Blades. Alright, Blades, you and me are going to train up against one another to aim for the champion's title. Yes, sir. I'm trying to, I'm trying to win, bro. The more we keep battling against one another, the more our Pokemon will grow. Huh? What's that? Yeah, what is that? Blades, would you look at this? They're wishing stars. Since there are two of them, you should take one for yourself. Okay, this kind of seems like good luck. Darn your bag. A stone found in the... Gather region with the mysterious power. It's said that your dreams come true if you find one. Well, with one of these, my Pokemon can Dynamax. They're gonna be massive, yes. Oh, so that's how you... Okay, I get it now. Trust you to pull something like this. They say wishing star fall down for those who have a true wish in their heart, you know? I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. I will be the greatest trainer ever. <laughs> there, I've said it three times, so surely my wish will come true now, right? Don't be silly, huh? Those wishing stars are composed of a curious sort of rock containing unknown power. They are one of the most precious resources we have here in the in the Gala region. But they won't do a thing for you in that state. Give them to me now and I'll have them, I'll have them sorted out for you. Ah, right. You've done heaps of research on the Dynamax phenomenon, haven't you, Professor? Then please, give Blades and me the power to Dynamax our Pokemon. First, we got the battle against that mad Pokemon in Slumbering World, and now this. It really feels like we're getting caught up in the adventure of a lifetime. I do understand your excitement, young man, but don't get carried away. You want to save your energy for tomorrow's journey. Oh, are we about to, like, go to sleep or something? Seems I came back home in the right time. Right in time for all the excitement. Hey, you lot. Why not have some dinner? You must be hungry, right? I've been totally obsessed with making the latest trendy curries. This story is just great. Like, I think, I think the last Pokemon game I truly enjoyed was, was probably, was probably in Pearl series. 
because your rival actually was a challenge, you know? And the story was great. It's morning at last, and time for our adventure to truly start. We spent the night here, okay. Good morning to you, young challengers. Hop, is it true you really met some Pokemon you didn't recognize? Is there anything more you could tell me about it? Uh, well, there was weird heavy fog, and then this even weirder Pokemon appeared. Blaze tried to fight it off, but then I think we both passed out or something. It's all pretty hazy. A right font of information you are. Blades, hop, these are for you. Are oh, you finished uh, with the Dynamax Witching Stars? Hey, Dynamax bands. These look pretty fire. I like them. It lets out a light that allows a Pokemon to Dynamax when at a power spot. Those are your Dynamax bands. I made them by fitting the wishing stars you found last night into those bands. Thank you, Professor. This is brilliant. It's just like the one Lee has on him, too. Now we can Dynamax our Pokemon like he does. My word, you don't waste any time, do you? I think you'll find it's not so simple as all that. There are a number of conditions you must meet if you hope to have your Pokemon Dynamax and take on that gigantic form. Now, don't be afraid to go to all sorts of places and meet all sorts of Pokemon that will help fill out your Pokédex, too. The legend of my reign is finally about to begin. Come on, Blades, I'll beat you to the station. This dude didn't always try to be first. Oh, what's... What can we... Ycom offers many ways to connect with other players. You'll be able to swap Pokemon, take part in Pokemon battles, and more. There's never a shortage of things to do. When stamps arrive on Ycom while you're out there on your adventure, move to other trainers or around and look for someone to connect with. Okay. Select a stamp that shows the silhouette of a Pokemon on it. You'll be able to team it with your fellow trainers to battle Pokemon. Oh, wow. Let me look at my profile. Oh, okay, you get to, you get to set, like, what you want your thing to be. Okay, uh, <laughs> funny enough. Oh, wow, he's a musician. We'll put the musician as... <laughs> Wait, did it let me? Yeah. That's the icon I want to choose to represent myself. And we're gonna do a surprise trade, I think. <laughs> I'll trade that other Nicket that I caught. Oh, okay, you just set it up there, and then someone will get it. One last thing before we raise blades, see, I've got some great advice for you. You have some signs you see Pokemon wandering out about out of the tall grass yet. If you move real slow and crouch down, those Pokemon won't pay you any notice. But on the other hand, if you whistle at them, you'll be sure to catch their attention. If you're a bit rubbish at whistling, just remember this need a fail proof trick. Press the left stick. Oh wow. Try it out and see who can catch the most Pokemon. I'm not about to waste my Pokeball, bro. I still got a hell of Pokemon to see. You remember Wedgehurst Station, right? Where we went to pick up Lee before? That'll be the goal, so see you then. I don't care about none of y'all. I'm really looking for that bug Pokemon. That's really what I'm surprised like I haven't seen it. Oh wow, Gamper was just out of here chilling. Oh wow, level 8. I don't know if it has like, uh, that ability to paralyze. Upon physical contact. But, honestly, I'm gonna, like, replace him with me now. Or we'll push me off with the answer, just to have on the team. Nice. Oh, that's definitely gonna parallel me, right? Wow, you got a crit off that. You did not have to get a crit off that, bro. Oh, yeah, that's right. I totally forgot it was Taylor on me, too. That's why that 
hit for so much. We're gonna try and capture you. <laughs> hey. Very popular as a herding dog in the Galar region as it runs a generous electricity from the base of the still. Sorry, Meow, you gotta go, buddy. Versus. Mm. Oh, wow. That's actually interesting. So you can, like, battle people in the area, I think? What am I doing? Yeah, I wanted to go to the bag because I wanted to get rid of that paralysis. I think there's a Pokemon Center too that I could have just killed up at, but I don't know. I'm overthinking it too much. Oh, there's the zigzag <laughs> The gallery region is again. And it's a dark normal type, so can't use a dark type on dark type move on you. I'm still trying to decide if I want to get far fetch so I can get surf fetch. Oh my god, we just got done getting you unparalyzed. I don't know why, like, I wanted, I got Groupie on my team, and I haven't really showed you guys Groupie because, I don't know, I like the design of Nicket. Nicket just looks really nice to me. on my team. I didn't really like its new evolution form too much. It seems like it's going to be the mascot for Team Yale though. I guess it wasn't meant to be. Oh wait, what? Hey, gotta revive. What is she, what is she waving for? I saw a hop sneaking off towards the station. What are you waving at though? I don't get it. Come on, Blades, you'll never beat me to the station at that pace. Oh, okay, the station is running up now. So I think when I first went in there and bought stuff, it wasn't really running. Yeah, me too there. Let me get this paralyzed off. <laughs> how they show like the different like language for like this game like we don't know what it's saying but they sure do okay i think you guys are like tired of seeing nick it out front so i think i'll show off uh groupie something oops <laughs> wrong way there we go Start with the blades, how many did you catch? I really, I caught a really special one, but look at how many you caught. Well, you're on your way to building a fine team. Wow, you taught, you giving us swift? Yeah, this move never misses. 
with the TM like that, you can teach your Pokemon to remove and fly, and you can use them again and again too. That one can teach them to switch. Lou gave it to me ages ago, and now it's yours. The gym trials will begin in Moto Soap. And our train's waiting, so let's go. Down them. I don't think I want to teach Swift to, to anybody. I don't think I have, like, special attackers on. Oh, now I have Choodle. Not quite so fast, you two. Ah, my mom showed up too. What are you doing here, mom? I knew this day was coming since the moment you chose Sable as a partner, darling. That was like one day ago. Professor Magnolia was kind enough to let us know that you two were setting out. So here, a last little gift to see you well set on your way. All the kit you'll need for camping. I appreciate it. We got a set of camping gear. Everything you need to set up a tent and get cooking in the wild area or at a camping spot. No matter what happens out there, if you and your partner are together, I know you'll be fine. Thanks, Mom. And just think how lucky you are. Mother to the first ever pair of champion brothers, because I'm certain to be champion next. You'll see. Of course you will be, darling. Anyway, do have fun and take care of yourselves. You'll be welcome back home anytime. And we're off. Wish us luck. Not that we'll need it. There are loads of brilliant trainers and all kinds of Pokemon out there waiting for us. My excitement is running ahead of me even faster than that train can go, Blades. Come on, we're off. Sorry, yes, sir. I'm ready to see some other Pokemon as well. I'm really excited for like all these all these Pokemon. I'm just trying to decide what my team compilation will be. I normally like to have dual typings on my team. But is surrounded by a vast wild area. Oh, I wonder if we'll get an old rod so we can fish. It's a real sight. There are all sorts of wild Pokemon just wandering about. Plus, you can camp out, do a spot of fishing. I don't think I could ever get tired of it. I'm not gonna lie. I, I low-key want a Gyarados on my team still. <laughs> Even though it'll take forever to level up. Hey, Mr. Station Master, isn't this the wild area? What are we stopped here? Yes, this is the wild air station. Make no mistake. I'm sorry to tell you that the train has halted due to a flock of woo on the tracks. What's there to be sorry about? This is brilliant. The wild area is massive. There are loads of Pokemon to battle here. You get it, don't you, Blades? This is the best possible place to put together the greatest team. I mean, if you say so. Hey, have you and Pikachu had a... No, I think I was mistaken. Don't mind me. Hey, have you and Eevee had a... Nah, it was just my imagination. Sorry to bother. Okay, I think that's reference to Pokemon Let's Go. Um, Pikachu and Let's Go Eevee. Yeah, they're giving something to people who've had a Let's Go experience. Do what in the world is a Let's Go... But what in the world is a Let's Go experience? Yeah, I didn't have Let's Go. I wasn't really interested in it. You're gonna run into stronger Pokemon the farther you go into the wild area. If you feel like you're in a pinch or in a battle, just use a Pokedoll. Dang, you gave me five of them things, too. The Man, strong Pokemon is, you'll be able to catch it eventually. So, as you join the gym challenge, you gather the gym badges. Okay. Ooh, and those are the Dynamax battles right there. But I don't know, I'm just so anxious to to catch more Pokemon still. Look at this. This looks nice. Look at that. That's Motostoke way off that way. And between there and here are countless new Pokemon waiting to be met. Oh, hello. And if it isn't Sonya. My grand gave me a proper earful in her own way. Those two young trainers are setting out on a journey, but what are you doing with your life? <laughs> that sounds rough. Ah, never you mind that. Nothing to worry yourselves over. Besides, I've been quite curious about that Pokemon you two met in the forest. I've been thinking I should look into it, so the timing works out for me. If I discover something really huge, then maybe even grand will admit I've got some talent. Yikes, being an adult has got its own challenges, huh? 
I said you needn't worry about it. I'm glad to be on the road, really. It's been ages. It'll be great fun to fish and camp and rough it outside again. Well, I'm off to go stick my head in as many of those red glowing dens as I can find. I'm going to battle the snot out of a bunch of Dynamax Pokemon and fill in another page in the tale of my legend. Oh, um, okay. What cheek? Dynamax Pokemon are really on another level, you know? You better Dynamax your partner Pokemon too if you want to take on opponents that strong. You'll find spots here and there in the wild area that emit a red beam of light. If you think you're up to it, check them out. There'll be Dynamax Pokemon lurking inside. So with that, how about I send you off with a little treat from me? Pokemon. Okay. A device that allows you to access the Pokemon storage system. There's some place where it works. So that's convenient. So you can swap out your team whenever you need to. Um, um, which has never been able to do in any Pokemon game previously. With the Pokemon Box Link, you'll be able to put your Pokemon from your team into your boxes or take Pokemon from your box, catching as many Pokemon as you'd like, and fill in some more of your Pokédex. The wild area is waiting for you. This is the start of your real adventure. I hope so. I need to get some bug Pokemon just to fill in the decks, level it up, and figure out what its evolutions are. That's what I'm really looking forward to. Shiny? Jar of honey. There's an onyx there? It's just a bunch of jars of honey. Yeah, let me battle this onyx. <laughs> Let's see what level you are. A very strong looking onyx. Twenty-six. Oh my god. Um, where's that item at? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, there was there was no way I was gonna beat that. Oh uh, wait, is that a tie rope? Wow. Okay. What level are you? Level 8? Honestly, if they came out with like a new evolution to the Tyro one, I probably would end up getting it. But, you know, I still like to fill up the Pokédex, so let's see if we can catch this Tyro real quick. Yeah, everybody already knows what a Tyrogue is. <laughs> and then those are Bunnelbees. We got Wingles. Wingles, Bunnelbees. One thing I'm not sure about right now is uh, if it's supposed to be raining, dark and raining, or if it's just that it's uh, 2, 2 a.m. for me and it is raining outside currently. I'm not too convenient to me. <laughs> but if you guys are enjoying this, um, I haven't came up with a question of the day or the video per se. So I guess I'll ask, what is everybody's favorite Pokemon and why is that your favorite Pokemon? Always comment down below with your with your answers. It's highly appreciated. I honestly don't want to catch the Bunnelbees. Ah, Butterfree. Uh, I can't even, I can't even interact with you like that. <laughs> oh, come on, bro. You chase after me? But we're going to check out that Dynamax. That Tyrogue really just chased after me, though. 
pillars of red light, you'll see the wild area of our Pokemon dens for Dynamaxing. Defeat a Dynamax Pokemon, you'll get a chance at catching it. Additionally, there are some rare items that you can only obtain by battling Dynamax Pokemon. When wild Pokemon Dynamax, they become incredibly powerful. They may unleash multiple moves in a row and take other actions you won't see in a regular battle. Okay. Um, it's a normal flying. Pokemon faint four times or the battle lasts for ten turns. Let's see if I can invite. So I, I do want to use my Grookey, but I don't know. If nobody joins up, then probably won't be able to do the Dynamax battle. Which I'm really looking forward to doing, no lie. So I'm not about to do the Dynamax battle by myself. And it's like a one star Dynamax battle, so I guess the more stars, the stronger the Dynamax battle is. I'm guessing. Okay. Well, it won't let me back out after clicking on that start or ready up thing. So we'll just. Oh wow, I could have just automatically did that for them to give me some some trainers to battle with me. <laughs> ah, that's it. Oh, my group key. They got a Snorlax, so uh, Quailfish, and then I can't remember what the other one's called. Ooh, okay, we're going Dynamax. said I never used Brown like the last video but this seems like the, the perfect time <laughs> to start using it. Superpower, why don't you just keep using uh, the other rock move? How do I know if you might be my I should have just done the max my groupie. I messed up on that. Expecting the Dynamax battle to be. <laughs> oh, 
Oh snap, you can get back in the battle. Okay, this is my chance to Dynamax. Oh no, I can't. It's like JK. Get off my group, he's gone. Okay. We got a hoot hoot. <laughs> Not my proudest moment for Pokemon. Whoa, we got all these? Five EXP candies, Dynamax candy, Red candy. And we got Tri Attack TM. Yeah, that's actually pretty nice. No EXP though. But I guess that's fine. Um, guys, I'm going to end off this video here. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing the Dynamax. I know that was pretty interesting for me. Why is that one pink? I might have to go to that one next video, guys. But I hope you guys enjoyed. Make sure you leave a like for the video. It helps out the video a lot. And also subscribe to my channel. It helps out the channel a lot. Hit that notification bell so you stay notified when I upload. And so that way you can keep up with the series. But with that said, guys, take it easy. Later.